Hello, everybody. Um, I just thought I'd share something kind of funny. It's Monday morning. Everybody needs something a little funny. Okay, so I was. I this is a Mafex Medica Invader. I'm going to do a review on it someday, but I'm going to need like someone else to hold the camera because he has so many. Mo like this is his. Uh, can you even see it? Here we go. I mean, it's so perfectly made in Japan and has wire in the cape, has this awesome base that, if you look around, will allow you to hold them up into like almost a floating position. Um, and the painting and everything. But anyway, he comes with a ton of accessories. So I'm taking my morning pills. I have a lot of stuff wrong with me. So I had to take about 21 pills a day. Anyway, so. I reach over, I grab, I grab this bottle, and I forgot that I had repurposed this bottle to get, <laughs> and I poured that out <laughs> to get my pills, and those are all the, uh, accessories that, that come with, with it, it has the, the Vader, this isn't from my YouTube, that, this is, it's a really good sculpt, I guess I'll show you it while I'm at it, I mean, they even did the matte uh, gray mixed in with the glossy black look at the all every one of those is just fully painted perfectly especially in person if you could see it and then it still has the burnt back of the head and you just pop it in and then through that hole you just pop in Vader's Vader's helmet I just kind of like the idea of him you know it looks different like that you know and then his hands up like he's going, oh no, everyone can see me. But I just like, and it comes with ten, uh, ten hands, uh, total, you know, different positions, all kinds of crazy different. One great, but one great one is I think I grabbed it. It comes with a stump. So now I would have liked if it was burnt, you know, looked just like when it was cut off. But it's still pretty dang cool. You take the arm off at the elbow, boom, put this in. Um, you can choose where you want it, how long you want it to be. Um, you take it off at the wrist, you can take it off, you know. I try to take off at the elbow because it seems more movie accurate. But um, I need to rewatch that scene. Um, but that, I just thought that was kind of funny. I opened up, pop a pill. I, I almost would have popped down, choked down literally been choked to death by Darth Vader <laughs> so that's I'll do a review on this Sunday and maybe it, I'll, I'll have somebody to hold it so that I can you know take take it apart oh one cool thing I gotta show you there's there's a wire that goes all the way through the cape and allows you to to give it different shapes so if I want to kind of give them a well, Batman action, you know, whatever. I mean, I, I prefer it kind of like a windblown look, you know, to it. And then also, like, his flaps, his shoulder guards are black, as they should be. And they move, they flap up so he can get all the way up, dynamic range and everything. The head looks so white from a, a distance, but when you're up close, let's see if we can get him up close personal there we go look you can even see there's fine detail down in the in the vocabulator that he uses they have the correct chain put in and uh let's see if i can show uh, i'll try to turn it without him falling i just didn't do a good job posing him last night because i was half asleep but they even follow the pattern of of the from Empire Strikes Back perfectly. But anyway, I just thought that would be a good morning laugh. <laughs> I almost literally got for I almost literally got choked out by Vader. <laughs> um, but I couldn't think of any other container to put them in, so. <laughs> I need to write Vader on the side of that. But normally, I keep it in a safe spot, but I was, I was messing with it last night to see if I I could do a video, and I it was just too hard. So, all right, there you go. But hopefully, you got a laugh out of that. 
I was about to totally just down it. 